and welcome to my reality Jeep Life with me, the Vermont Jeep Girl, and this is my daily vlog of 2013. I'm out here with Lola right now. I would like to go get her inspected in a little bit, but before I can do that, I need to fix her mirror that she lost this past weekend. Yeah, I was out in Mattawee Off-Road Extreme Park up at the Gear Jam this weekend. I didn't have Old Blue ready in time, so I took Lola up there. Um, didn't really technically go off-roading with her, but I needed to get to my campsite. In order to just get to my campsite, there was a serious, gigantic mud quicksand sucking puddle. And there was no way that little old stock Lola could go through that. I don't have any tow points on her whatsoever. She's just my daily driver and my road rig. So there was a little thing that I could go around. And when I went around, I had to pull the mirrors in, so my friend Emily pulled the mirror in, and when she did, the glass fell out. But I got lucky because it didn't break. It's still all in one piece. As you can see, and I don't know if you can also see, you can kind of see some of the, the scrape marks on old Lola here. See if we can get you to see it. I'm pretty sure those will just buff out. Let's see if we can get them. There they are. So the first thing that I need to do is I need to remove the old glue that's on the back of this mirror. And I'm going to extremely, very carefully try to use this razor blade because I don't want to ruin the mirror part, which actually this is doing well. The sun here, it's warmed up. Just by using this flat razor blade, I was able to scrape the blobs of old glue off of here and I'll show you one of them. It scraped it right off. So now what I'm going to do is I got new adhesive I'm going to put on here. What I'm going to be using is a double-sided uh, sticky type tape. It's it's a little thick, but it's very, very sticky. And this is the stuff that they use on, like, a trim and stuff for the car. I was going to use the kind that you squeeze out, kind of like a, uh, like a bonding cement. But my friend at the parts store said to try this. So I am going to try this and, you know, see what happens. I think what I'm going to do with it is I'm going to, there's several little curve and grooves like where the glue was on the other side. So I think I'm going to Crazy. All right. <laughs> now that I've pulled off the sticky part from the other side of the tape, I'm now ready to stick my mirror in there. Like I said, I've never used this before, so I'm not really sure what's going to happen, but I guess we'll find out.
pretty painless, huh? I'll put it this way. As long as it stays in there long enough to go get my inspection, I will be happy.